Hey, what's up guys? Austin here. So I've had a few requests to do an episode on Keith Carlock. So that's what we're going to do today. So there's a lot about Keith Carlock you could study, like his unusual but effective technique or his groove concepts. But uh, today we're going to be looking at his mastery of the paradiddle diddle. So let's go to the computer. We'll take a look at what he's doing and we'll see if we can break it down. All right, cool. So this is Keith Carlock from his uh, Vic Firth performance spotlight. So let's take a look at the clip we're going to isolate. We'll loop it a few times and we'll see what he's doing. Pretty badass, right? Okay. So over here in Logic, this is the transcription I have. I'll just play it for you real quick. All right. Okay. So you can see that this concept is based on pretty fast 30 second notes. And it's comprised mainly of double strokes and this paradiddle diddle concept with two kicks leading into it. So you'll see him do this uh, a lot in his fills and solos and stuff like that. He's really got it down to a fine science. So uh, let's go to the kit. We'll break this thing down some more and we'll see if we can play it. Okay, so let's start with this paradiddle diddle concept. So in its most basic form, the pattern is right, left, right, right, left, left, with the two singles being strong accents, and then you add two kicks at the end. So the pattern is paradiddle diddle kick kick. Okay, so I'll play you an example of that. Now the next step is to take those two accented singles and orchestrate them around the toms and the snare. So here's an example of that. Okay, so now that we have that, we can start to experiment with adding more double strokes into that pattern. So it'll become paradiddle diddle 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 kick kick. Okay, and then we can alternate that back and forth with the original pattern. So here's an example of that. All right, so now that we have that, we can start to apply it like Keith does in a solo. So um, I'm going to try to play what I have transcribed out. So I'll just put it at the bottom so you guys can follow along. And I'm just going to try to play it from slow to fast. And uh, I didn't feel like learning the uh, splashes with the hi-hat with the left foot. So don't give me too much of a hard time about that. Okay, so let's see if I can do it.
All right, so what makes Keith Carlock so good with this is that he has these patterns internalized so well that he can just spontaneously come up with different combinations and phrasings for it depending on what he's playing. So that's really the main goal of this is to train this into your muscle memory to the point where you can just come up with your own combinations on the spot uh, while you're playing. And you'll see a lot of other really good players uh, use the same uh, concept in their own ways. So it's definitely uh, a good one to have in your vocabulary, especially if you're into like fusion and stuff like that. So um, I'll leave you guys with that. Thanks for watching. That is the Keith Carlock Paradiddle Diddles. So uh, go and hit that like button. If you like this video, go ahead and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care.